Samsung's TouchWiz software on the Galaxy S8 puts tons of customization at the user's fingertips. In a recent update, Samsung added yet another customization to the navigation bar. Now you can hide it altogether. Here's how. Like on most Android devices with on-screen navigation buttons, the navigation bar will hide itself in certain situations, such as when you're viewing a full-screen video. This maximizes the screen real estate and, in the case of a game, can keep you from accidentally backing out of it. However, in other apps like the browser or Twitter, the navigation buttons remain in place. If you want to cram more information on the screen, where those pesky software buttons would normally be, you can now do that. After the update, you might have noticed a dot to the far left of the navigation bar. Tapping that dot will toggle whether the navigation bar automatically hides or not in any application. If you don't see the dot, you may need to enable the feature in Settings. Go to Settings, Display, Navigation Bar, and then tap the toggle beside Show and Hide button to switch it to the on position. If you don't see this option at all in Settings, check for any available software updates. The update may not be out for some carrier-specific Galaxy S8 models just yet. When the navigation bar is set to Auto Hide, you will see a gray circle with a white center and the navigation bar will be a translucent gray. When Auto Hide is disabled, the circle will be solid gray and the navigation bar will be the color that you've selected. When the navigation bar is hidden, you can still press with force where the home button should be to return home. To show the navigation bar, just swipe up from the bottom of the screen. It will remain visible for only a few seconds and then slide off the bottom of the screen once more. For more tips and tricks and other how-tos, be sure to check out cnet.com forward slash how-to.